would you ever try and underlay a thing like maybe with a wig artificial hair or something would you ever try it if you would comment the comment section would you try with your own hair no ways would you even dye your own hair that's the question to ask hello everybody hi how are you all doing anyways it's manu on you know and um today i'm going to dye my hair i wanted to do this underlayer thing um when i did my hair red this is red that has faded by the way when i did my hair red and you all know i use a deposit only color so it doesn't bleach it doesn't contain any ammonia or peroxide that damage your hair or anything it just goes to deposit color and leaves your hair when it's time to leave today i'm going to try and do the underclass since my hair has faded i'm going to do like put this is the color that i'll be under so put that color under and then dye the top of my hair but you never know we'll see what happens. and i also have to twist my hair because we might be going on a trip but anyways i'm going to wash my hair when i wash my hair and everything i'll come and then we'll put the color in hmm. okay so i've kind of like divided you see even with the division this side is lighter because i tried to do this before blah 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 um this is the division i know it's not so even but that's why i want to be down because even though i've divided it like this this is going to bleed on this so eventually it's a bit smaller than this which i want i know i should like put the dye in my whole head because the lighter my hair is the weaker it is and you all know i don't bleach my hair every time i dye my hair my hair is already bleached and the bleach i use is semi permanent and it's a deposit only color you have to lighten your hair before you use it and my hair has been lightened already like i've been dying my hair for four years and i've bleached my hair twice so the last time i bleached my hair was december in 2019 and then 2020 and i've changed my hair color several times i keep getting asked whether the bleach doesn't damage my hair when i change my hair color when i don't even use bleach when dyeing my hair the color i'm using is a deposit only color it doesn't contain any ammonia and peroxide it just goes to deposit color and leaves the hair which gives me the opportunity to put a different color on it and i use the same brand all the time just by the way <laughs> so i should but then i want to, i kind of want to do the put it out of a color this is mostly red like crimson but then i mixed it with all the other ones yes i'm just going to start putting it on this side but i should secure this one first right so i'm just going to slather this on it no technique nothing just slather and it's just going to do here see what i'm talking about this is just a deposit only color this face has nothing to go deposit it's all black this place i've removed the black so it can deposit i feel like stressing on that <laughs> oh my goodness oh my goodness okay red <laughs> okay as you can see i can do this and it won't even dye the black part Whew. so um i'm going to wash my hands i'll keep it in for about 40 minutes 40 45 minutes and then go wash it out then i'll come back here and show you guys how it looks deep conditioner also then come back here and show you guys how it looks okay i just rinse it out it's been oh wow hours uh i've been doing some stuff so i'm not coming to like deep conditions and everything i just rinse it out it's currently five something it's almost six i'm going to deep condition this real quick and come back here and show you guys how it looks okay <laughs> oh my god this will look really nice but then like um wow so i have deep conditioner marinating on my hair and i'll go wash this out and we'll see how it finally looks um and also i'm supposed to put soup on fire so <laughs> i'm going to do that eee! 
okay you all i love it like the part on it is making it look white and the fact that it was dry so it kind of like didn't make the butter slide onto the hair but i'm not even bothered because <laughs> people it's really dry and i'm extremely high porosity but like your <laughs> this looks good and i'm so happy with the results uh oh hope you guys enjoyed this video um would you ever try an underlayer thing like maybe with a wig artificial hair or something would you ever try it if you would comment your comment section would you try with your own hair no ways would you even dye your own hair that's the question to ask like i feel like it's not really popping right now because right now the butter on my hair and the weather has really made it so white and the butter on my hair has kind of like toned down the red but the under layer oh my goodness i'm so excited anyway Hope you have a lovely day. Bye.